Yo, what's up guys, Skyline here. Um, today I'm gonna bring you another tutorial. This one is going to be how to make your PC or laptop look like a Mac. Okay, so first of all, you're gonna want to download a program called Rocket Dock. And here's how you can get that. Just go to the internet. And just go to Google. Type in Rocket Dock. Enter. And you're going to want to click on the very first link. Go to this website. Click download. And download Rocket Dock. Save it. And by the way, guys, um, I've already had this. I just had to delete it, so I decided since I'm gonna get it again, I might as well just do a tutorial on it. So yeah, you're gonna want to run it. Hang on, we'll just let it load for a minute. All right. You're gonna want to pick whatever language you are. Next, I accept. Next, and next, and create a desktop icon. Then next, install. And it shouldn't take that long to install, unless you have like bad connection. So yeah, there's that. Then you're gonna wanna open the program and there you go. And you'll get that little dock like that. And you you can just uh add all of these to the icon. You can just go like that and then drag them in there. Then they'll all be in there. Or at least they should be. See, there you go. And if you would rather have it down at the bottom, um you can move this thing over. And you're gonna want to right click on anything and just go on screen position. And you can pick top, bottom, left, or right. And I'm just gonna go to the bottom. And there are all of them. And this is one thing that I would like to tell you. Um, when I am on the internet and I have this on, uh, it kind of gets annoying when I try to hit the minimize button or whatever. So, you can just, uh, wait, alright, you can just right click on it and go on auto hide, and that will just get out of the way for you, like you would be regular, and so that's very helpful. And another thing you can do to get, like, little widgets and stuff, you can go to the internet, and you can type in on Google. Type in widgets for YouTube. Widgets for YouTube. Whoa, spelling error. <laughs> okay, and you're gonna wanna go to the link that has Yahoo. Uh, I just saw it. Where did it? And usually there's a Yahoo link on here, but if there's not, you can just type in for Yahoo. Then click on this right here, widgets, oh, right here. We're going to go down to, like, I think it's the third, or oh, first link, yeah. And just click on that. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys, this is really laggy. And here you go, you, you we're going to want to sign in. Unless you don't have the Yahoo account, then you can make one, or it doesn't really matter. And you're going to go to Find Widgets, and usually I go to Top Downloads. And you can search whatever one right here. Like, I'll just search the iPhone, or the iPod one. That's where, like, there's an iPod on your screen, and uh, you can control your whole iTunes from it. So, that's pretty sick. 
And here's another cool one, the neon clock. And whichever one you want, you just click on get it and click download right there. And it should bring up well hang on. My computer is being terrible today. Alright, it should bring up this. And if you don't already have the Yahoo widgets installed, you're gonna have to just click on supporting software and that should take you to another link. And you're gonna wanna scroll over to where it says get started now and just click on that and download widget starter pack right there. And you're just gonna wanna download that and then whenever that gets in downloading you can just save it or whatever. And then you can just click on that, the download the new widget, and the link would be right there at the bottom. So that's pretty much it. And once you download the widget, uh, I, it's gonna give you a little widget toolbar over there. Um, and you just go over to that, and it, your widget should be on there, and just click it and drag it over to your desktop, and then it'll be on there, and you can just drag it to wherever you want, pretty much. And that's pretty much it guys, um, please subscribe for more tutorials, and I'm out, peace.